I'm starting off by asking everybody this question because things, you know, it was such a big ending to season <laughs> one there, <laughs> right? <laughs> so, uh, and you know, without getting into detail, obviously, because I understand we can't get... Spoilers. Yeah. Spoilers. But, you know, where can we find you guys at the start of season two? Well, Julia, you know, she left off with the beast. Yeah. Um, Knifed his neck. Hey, <laughs> hey, man, you gotta do what you gotta do. Exactly. Um, she is with the beast currently. They are on a little, you know, a little excursion together. Yeah. I think that's as far as I can take it, but you get to see uh, Julia and the beast in that relationship a little bit, which is exciting for mm -hmm. season two. And uh, I can't reveal where I am, but I've taken off somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> and um, you'll have to watch to see where and when I come back. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, and, and she's uh, basically has revenge in her mind at this point, right? I think so. I think it's like, you know, void of any sort of human emotion and just like uh, on adrenaline at this point. It's like just wanting to like fight back for, for what was taken from her and, and what was done to her and just seeing red, you know, and, and, and also like behind any anger there's sadness, an immense amount of sadness. So sure. I think it's just trying to trying to trying to get those feelings out and the way to do that is right now through killing this man. Right. Or this, you know, spirit demon. Right. right whatever right. whatever he what do you is, want to call that, it? Like, yeah, <laughs> his fox. So you know the show has just such an amazing fan base. Uh, it's it's really struck yeah. a chord. You know, yeah. So in you know you guys you did the press tour at the beginning before the show came out, so now you're about to go in front of your fans again after season one behind you. I mean, what, what do you think it is? How, well, first of all, how do you guys react to that fan base? And second of all, what do you think it is that just hit with them, you know? I love our fans. I think that, like, I, I mean, fans are the most important thing. You know, we want to do due diligence from the books and, and with the show, and it's a show for fans made by fans. You know, we all yeah. read the books. We love them. Uh, they keep us going. I mean, I, I love that people are responding to our characters, Julia, Absolutely. Katie, I mean, the whole cast uh, and the, and the storyline. And, you know, just try to try to make them happy. Yeah. Try to make you guys happy. Absolutely. Um, I think, yeah. Yeah, I mean, for me, it's, it's really inspiring to see the fans and how it's impacted them and to see that we're really doing our job and, um, and allowing, you know, Lev's work to, um, to speak for itself and to um, hopefully do it justice for the fans because I mean without them there would be no show yeah. really and, you know they do veer away from the books you know yeah, a lot, and quite which, a bit, yeah, yeah quite which a bit we yeah. have Lev's blessing on which is great you know John and Sarah and he's there every step of the way but it's nice to have that leniency and, and, and hope that the fans can be patient with the fact that we're not going by the guidelines of these books specifically, just kind of spinning away from them a little bit and, and hopefully they respond to that. Yeah. In a great Absolutely. way, which so far so good. Yeah, yeah I was gonna say, yeah. they seem to be Well, you guys like are gonna so have far. an amazing panel, I'm yeah. sure. So Thanks. congratulations thank you. and thank you so, thank you so much. much for coming cool. by. Thank you, I appreciate it.